Okay, you guys, hello, what is up, and welcome back to my channel. So, I know this lighting is honestly not the best, and it's kind of whatever. My house is just has really shitty lighting everywhere, so I just kind of got to work with it. So, as you can tell by the title of this video, I am going to be doing a what's in my gym bag. So, I'm not going to make this intro super duper long. First off, I do want to disclaim, if you guys watch my vlogs, you know I never do my makeup, I never do my hair or anything. I'm not, I'm not a big girly girl, but I swear I did not actually just do my hair and makeup just for this. I actually do have plans tonight, that's why I did this. I was not going to do it just for a video. That's why I've been pushing this off for so long. So, without further ado, let's hop into the video. Okay, so what's in my gym bag? I actually just got a new gym bag. It is this one, it is from Gymshark. Super nice, has a bunch of little compartments everywhere, and you can like extend it if you need to. And yeah, I'll open it up. So inside there's like, sorry, I'm doing a really bad job of showing you, but there's little like separators in here and there's also a zipper and it's just super duper cute. And where it shows Gymshark up on the front here, it's like actually Velcros. So I love that, but I'll go ahead and pop it up on the screen. That way you guys know what price and exactly what it's called. But in regards to what is inside of it, so I've actually, a couple of these items were in my favorites video from a while back, but I'll just hop right into it. So I always keep in my gym bag my PE Science Prolific and High Volume. I use the flavor Sour Green Apple. I love these. They are seriously so good. It literally tastes like a fun dip. My other favorite flavor is Melon Berry Twist. Absolute fire. So I keep these in here. The high volume is like a, there's no caffeine in it or anything. It's just a pump product and then Prolific does contain caffeine. But what differentiates PE Science from other, like most supplement brands, they do not have any beta alanine in it. And beta alanine, that stuff is what makes you feel really jittery, tingly, and makes you like, almost like that burning sensation. I get that whenever I have beta alanine, everyone reacts different to it, but I don't like that feeling. So PE Science is my go-to with that. Okay, and then next up is the good old barbell pad. This is key, especially for hip thrust. I love doing hip thrust. I think I got this off Amazon for like $13. Once again, all this stuff, I will be popping up on the screen. That way you know the exact titles and I will link it in the description box for you. But a barbell pad. This one I just got off Amazon. You can get like a fancier brand and some of them like Velcro shut. This doesn't, I don't have any problems with it though. And if you're squatting and you're someone who doesn't like the pressure like on you at all, these are super handy and just overall a really good purchase. I've had this for over two years now and literally it looks like it's in perfect condition. Okay and then next up is just this little tripod. I literally carry this around just in case like I'm vlogging that day and I need to like film anything in there. It's just more smaller and subtle. So I literally got this at five below so I can't really link this for you guys. It was just a really, it's really cheap and like you can tell actually holding it in person. But it's just something I like to keep in there because I do film all the time. And then another thing in regards to tripods is this big old baby. So this thing is literally my favorite. I actually use this whenever I take photos of myself. This is what I use because it has this little lovely thing that, that pops right on out. It's a little remote and I can just sync it up to my phone and then it's really subtle. I can just hide that in my hand and click that to take the photo. So I love that, but it's also what I use to film all of my workouts while in the gym. I'm sorry, this is going out of focus. I like this one because my camera, in order to post them on Instagram, you have to have it like turn to the side so it's a side profile not like the youtube layout so the little top part right here just adjusts so it can go up and down you can twist this and it unlocks it to different heights and it can go like literally so freaking long if i needed it to like that's all the way back there so this thing is like literally as tall as me but it's super handy and i was only like 30 or 40 dollars online literally such a good purchase if you're someone like me that does any sort of vlogging or you record your workouts that type of thing okay and then next thing is my trusty beats i love these these are my rider dies so i believe they are the beats studio 3 i'm not 100 percent sure which ones they are they are overall like the ones that, that actually go around your head here are what mine look like. They are the like rose gold and then also dark gray. They are, they're quite large. I look really funny right now, but 
I do really like them. I always have my hair up in a bun so they never really fall back because it kind of just sits in the perfect place. They are noise canceling so you literally cannot hear freaking anything with these. They are amazing and as you just saw, they easily just snap like that and boom. They also hold charge. I've had these for probably going on like two years. I got them whenever I got my MacBook and they literally have only died I think twice. So they hold battery so freaking easy. I rarely ever charge them and they last just forever so it's super nice. Another thing that I have just comes in this pouch to keep it stored which I like. It's kind of like the little like drawstring. Is that what you call these little thingies? To tighten it. But it is a lifting belt. I really do not use this that often unless I'm trying to like pull a new PR for deadlift or some sort of squat like that. I do this just because I don't want to harm myself. You don't really need this at all. It's just a lot of people do that. Although if you do use a belt, don't use it all the time because a lot of people would just use their belts 24 seven. I'm sorry. I feel like this keeps going out of focus on my face. But a lot of people use their belts 24 seven and it makes it so they don't actually have any core strength and stability. So they literally like rely on this. Do not do that. But I just have this. It is a size small of the one I ordered. I will once again, link it for you. It's super easy. It's literally just Velcro that I'm not gonna do it cause it's really loud, but you pull it apart, loop it through there, goes around your waist. I always put it underneath my sweatshirt so people can't see it whenever I do use it. Just cause it's awkward, but that's that super easy and explainable i feel by the way i'm sorry i feel like this keeps going in and out of focus i never can tell until i'm editing it and then i'm like oh my god that's so annoying but it is what it is okay next thing up comes in another cute little package gymshark my love so in here i just have their lifting straps i do have the grip ones i actually just got these recently but how these work they have the cute little Gymshark logo right there. And then they have like the grip that you can obviously see. So you just put them on your wrist. Like if I can tighten it like this. And then you wrap it around like the thing. Like I only ever use this with not bar. I'm using anything like barbells. I never use it for like pull-ups or dumbbells or anything like that. Just if I'm trying to lift heavier weight that like, I don't know, it's hard. Because my hands, I'm someone, my hands get sweaty really easy. So that's why I like to have these. But you don't want to, once again, just like the belt, you don't want to completely rely on this. You actually want to build a grip strength. So just use this. It like wraps around the bar. Then you're able to pull up and it just stays on a lot nicer. I love this. I did not get these until recently, honestly. So I went over like basically like two years without ever having that. So these aren't needed. None of this is needed. I'm just telling you guys what I personally like and I have found that works best for me. My most favorite thing about sit down videos like this you guys, first of all, you can only see a certain amount of my background. You can't tell if the rest of my room is really dirty or not. Just kidding, it actually isn't. I did clean it for this video. So, I feel blessed, guys. I gave it so you have a slightly more aesthetic pleasing. A slightly more, a slightly more pleasing. I don't even know at this point. Okay, next up, that is everything I keep in like the main portion of my bag but in the little zipper that i was telling you guys about i just keep <laughs> good old covid 2020 i keep an extra mask just in case and then i keep he these in here so these attach to any tripod that i have and it's just something they're both to hook my phone in in case i need to take a photo of some sort or i don't want to film my workout on my actual camera and i want to film it on my phone for that day okay and then in another little zipper on here I just keep some chalk. This is literally, I keep it in a baggie so it doesn't get all over my bag because it's in this little thing and you just like, whenever you need it, you kind of just like squeeze it like that. But I honestly don't ever use chalk. Uh, very, very rarely if I'm like doing some more like calisthenics, like bar work, something like that, I will do it just because like I said, my hands do get sweaty. So it just makes it so you can grip on easier. So I never use that. It's really not needed. I didn't even buy that. Scott got it for me. So. But it is really nice to have in case I decide to switch up my training. And then last but certainly not least, this little like side net part. I just keep my camera case that way it's easily accessible because most times I do vlog. So just my camera case that's in a little thing. It's really super simple. So you definitely don't need this. This is just personally what I like to do. So I have these things on me because a lot of the times, honestly, I'll get to the gym and kind of switch up my training. So I just want to be prepared and have it all with me. So. That is really that. I hope you guys found this video useful maybe and 
if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Other than that, thank you guys for watching this video. I love you and I will talk to you in the next one.